Welcome back guys on this wonderful Monday afternoon. We're back for another video. As always, today's video we're going to be talking about 10 signs that you're awakening right now. And when you're awakening, it can be very confusing. This journey can be very odd at times, very frustrating, very nerve-wracking as well. But anyway guys, let's get straight to the video. The first sign is you're starting to see a lot of synchronicities. You're starting to see 11-11 a lot. You may think it's just a coincidence, but coincidences are not real. In fact, everything happens for a reason. So if you're seeing 11-11 right now, like every time you're looking at the clock, it's 11-11. It's basically a code that's telling you it's time to wake up. Like you're waking up in the matrix. You're starting to realize a lot of things. You're starting to see all these synchronicities. You look at the clock, it's 12-11-11. You look at license plates, it may be 11-11. You look at social media, you see 11-11. You're starting to see a lot of synchronicities. That's one of the first signs that you're starting to awaken. The second sign is your perspective has shifted a lot. You may have been cursing a lot. You may have done other things that you regret doing. You may have been having bad habits before and now you're starting to break those habits. In this second sign, you're basically shifting your perspective onto the bigger picture. You're starting to see things from an elevated mind state. Things aren't the same anymore for you. Life has basically changed, but life has changed for the better. Now what I mean by life has changed is since your perspective has changed, you're starting to awaken, you're starting to see things differently now. It will be very odd and very confusing at times, but be assured that this is all meant to happen. You're supposed to watch this video right now. You're meant to watch this video. So yeah, guys, that's the second sign. The third sign is that you're starting to see things differently now. And by that, it's not the same as second sign. This is basically when you're looking at certain things, it looks way different now. Things don't look at how they used to. They look more realistic now. You pay more attention to the, the details of a certain object. You look at that object and you're just very amazed by how that object looks. Or for example, you may be outside, you're just looking at rocks and you're just looking at the details. Every little detail of that rock, you're looking at it and you're just amazed by how, how very detailed that rock is created how it's made, how it feels, how it looks. See, in this sign, you're basically starting to unlift the veil. You're seeing the world how it's meant to be like that. See, when you're looking at things from this perspective, this point of view, you're basically seeing the planet how it's supposed to be seen. It looks very sharpened now. It looks more realistic. It looks brighter. Nature may look very bright to you now. The colors are enhanced. Nature is enhanced to a high level now. The colors, the complexity of all the trees and leaves, it looks way better to you. It looks more realistic. The fourth sign is you're starting to be more patient now. You may not have been patient in the past, but now, in the present, you're becoming more patient and you're just letting things go how it's supposed to go. You're not rushing anything anymore. You're starting to see things very clearly. You're becoming more patient to the point where you may pursue certain things and now you're not rushing it. You don't care about how long it's going to take, but you just know that it's going to happen. What's meant to be will be. You think like that now. The fifth sign is... You're starting to believe in yourself a lot more now. You have a lot of self-belief and you now understand that you have to believe in yourself in order for these certain things that you pursue to happen. You now know that when you have self-belief, your dreams will come true because you believe in yourself. Because you need to believe in yourself for others to believe in you. You're starting to realize that. And now that you have all this self-belief, you're starting to pursue very different stuff. You may have just started to pursue a different career. The sixth sign is you're starting to be more attuned to creative things. You're starting to draw, perhaps. You're starting to do things creatively, like maybe you're starting to paint. You're starting to make music. You're starting to make videos as well. You're starting to do anything that fuels your creative 
energy inside of you you're starting to do a lot of things like you're starting to create more things you're starting to create oh, yeah, guys your creative energies have been released now they're being activated so that's what sign is when your creative energies are being activated you're starting to be more creative and that is why you start to pursue more different creative journeys you know you start to draw color you may be coloring but you may start coloring um painting you may start doing gfx by that i mean is design and stuff like that you may start painting on shoes anything creative you're starting to do the seventh sign is that you're starting to awaken now is you're becoming more alert of how your eating habits are you stop overeating you start going on a different diet you're starting to work out now you're starting to do a lot of fitness related activities and you're starting to realize that you need to nurture your body in order for you to align onto the mind body and soul because you need to align your body with the soul and the mind and to do that you must be fit you must be healthy so you're starting to realize that now and when you're realizing that you're gonna start working out a lot now maybe like you're starting to create your own little diet you're starting to eat healthier you're starting to cut out chips perhaps you're starting to cut out certain foods like fast food junk food. starting to cut that out and certain foods won't appeal to you anymore for example certain foods such as meats and that like meats that doesn't appeal to you anymore you lose your appetite for that your appetite is changing and your diet is changing also and you're starting to get more fit the seventh the seventh sign that you're awakening is you're starting to meet more people with the same thought level as you the same wavelength and you're starting to cut out certain people out of your life because you're starting to realize that they don't match your wavelength they think differently than you they may not be awakened right now and you just don't want to hang out with certain people who are not awakened you're starting to meet people who think exactly like you. The universe is bringing all these newer people towards you. And you're starting to converse with them. You're starting to be friends with them. So yeah, guys. The seventh sign, you're basically starting to meet new friends. Who have the same thinking level as you. But we all have different perspectives. The eighth sign is you're starting to realize that this truth is still the truth but however everyone has their own truth in their own perspective but yet the truth is still the truth because it's still the truth it's universal Therefore, what i mean by that is everybody has their own perspective and everybody perceives the world differently so you're starting to realize that we have our own perspective onto the truth i say my own truth you might disagree with that but yet my truth is still the truth and your truth is still the truth because it's all the truth just in my own perspective so whatever i perceive is true and whatever you perceive is true because look there's always two sides to a story there could be a number it could be it could be a six and then a nine one person right here and there's another person right here and there's a six in the middle this person over here sees it as a nine and this person sees it as six so by what i mean by that is everybody has their own perspective there's two sides to every story so everyone will have their own perspective onto everything everybody perceives this world differently so what i think of something won't be the same thing of what you think of that certain thing so i could explain something like such as some apple i can say this apple is very good and then i say it in my own words in my own perspective and then you go on to say oh yeah this apple is very good but in your own perspective in your own words it's still the truth but in your own perspective and in my own perspective do you know what i'm trying to say now so yes you're starting to realize that we have our own perspective to the truth and it is still the truth at the end of the day because we have our own perspective to the eighth sign is you're starting to be more cautious about how you're sleeping lately you're changing your sleeping habits you may have used to sleep late sleep late in you may may have not sleep enough hours sufficiently enough but now you're starting to realize that sleep is very important for your well-being so you're starting to sleep early and you're starting to wake up a little bit earlier now you may have woke up very late but now you're waking up early you're changing your sleeping habits 
that's one of the eight signs that you're trying to awaken because when you start to awaken your sleeping habits start to change our body has this clock basically it's a it's our sleeping clock and what that does is whatever time you sleep then the next day that clock is gonna wake you up depending on how many hours you sufficiently slept because you need eight hours of sleep so if you sleep around 10 you're gonna wake up around nine or six or seven if you sleep around 11 and you're starting to have this good sleeping habits you're gonna start to wake up earlier around like eight or nine so yeah guys the eight sign is you're changing your sleeping habits the ninth sign you're starting to awaken is you're starting to hear things you're starting to feel things and you're starting to realize a lot of things but i feel things is you're starting to feel certain energies from other people and you're starting to hear noises in your head by noises you may be hearing this white noise static you may start hearing static you're starting to hear white noise static you're starting to hear static that is called clear audience you're starting to develop your clear audience so clear audience is well hearing you're starting to hear things very clearly now and when you're feeling certain energies that's called clairsentience you're starting to feel energies so for example you may be just chilling and you just feel energy something. tap your shoulder you just that's clairsentience a, a being a spirit being is touching your shoulder it's trying to make its presence known to you and at times this can overwhelm you but you have to be assured that the the other beings on the other side they can do no harm to you because we're on the physical plane and they're on the spiritual plane so even though you can feel their energies that just means that there's a thin layer between the physical plane and the spiritual plane for you you're becoming more clear audience and clear sentient you're starting to feel things and you're starting to hear things different the tenth and final sign that you're awakening is you're starting to develop your clear senses your clear abilities such as clairvoyance clear empathy clear sentience clear tangency clear gustance clear scent clear audience and channeling that is all guys thank you guys for watching this video i will explain the clear senses in a separate video so yeah guys thank you guys for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope this helped you a lot thank you all for watching i love every single one of you that watches my videos i appreciate every single one of you that watches my videos thank you so much namaste peace and love and light and like always guys be humble show gratitude always and just spread love man because love is the powerful drug of them all so yeah guys thank you guys for watching make sure to spread this video with your friends and family and don't forget to like the video like the video guys please make sure you like the video and comment something positive thank you guys for watching i'm out